Hey, so this is the reflection topic three. Practices of des describing. Please compare and contrast the way that Margaret Mead describes her subjects in bathing a baby uh, in three cultures or trance and dance in Bali with the way Ron Frick describes his subjects in Baraka. Well, let's start with bathing a baby in three cultures. And uh, the title is exactly what it describes. So um, the first culture would be an African culture. Um, it shows a more rigorous and um, harder job to bathe children, especially with clean water. Um, they do not have very clean water at all, so they have to make do with what they have. So um, it's, liter it's um, literally super hard to raise children in Africa. Um, more so, you know, bathing them and take care of them, um, make sure they have clean water and food and health. So when Margaret Mead was narrating this, she was describing um, what it is like, uh, or more so narrating what it's like to um, uh, go through the daily routine of uh, bathing um, an African child. For the second um, scene in bathing a baby in um, three cultures, it shows um, a white uh, male baby. Uh, with a mother and um, compared to bathing African children it's so different it's ridiculous um, he has a crib um, she changes his diaper regularly um, it's just a whole whole different life um, so you, you gotta wonder that that baby is uh, not necessarily gonna grow up to be happier but he's gonna be He's going to have enough resources and, you know, schooling, whereas the African baby um, will not. Now, the film Baraka uh, by Ron Frick uh, is very similar to um, one of the first scenes in Bathing a Baby in Three Cultures, um, but it's more so on a global scale. Um, he went through 24 countries in 14 months uh, just to make this film. Um... He had a computer-controlled camera, uh, so he had all the time-lapse shots, uh, so he had all the technology, so it was not like uh, Margaret Mead's film style at all, where it's black and white, she's narrating, uh, granted this is 40 years down the road, but um, he does have the technology. Um, where it is similar is, um, as I said, when African children were bathing there, um, they're young um, in the lake um, or river or whatever. Um, this documentary is pretty much the same as far as following tribes around and um, kind of filming their um, simple life scenes.